All right, the next drill we're gonna do is called a jump back T drill. And the reason that we wanna uh, instill this drill into our program for our players, especially our young developmental players, is a big problem that faces young hitters is the ability to ride the back knee. And we're gonna talk a little bit more and give you some visuals to what that looks like. But essentially, we want our guys to continue momentum once the swing starts and never really stop that in the course of our swing. Because obviously, once momentum is started and then stopped, it's very hard to recreate that momentum, okay? So what we wanna do is put them in a position where they have no option but to rely on their athleticism. So the way this drill is gonna work is we're gonna set it up. Uh, now we're, we're, we're looking at a pitch in the good part of the strike zone, anywhere from the upper thigh to about mid, mid torso. And we're gonna start with our hitter, even with the T, okay, feet inside the shoulders. And what's gonna happen here is our hitter's gonna jump back, kind of ride that inside knee. And what I mean by that is, go ahead and keep that knee up, coach. What's gonna end up happening is we wanna keep the weight on the inner part of this inside knee and then drive forward. And it's all gonna come in one motion, okay? So once again, we're gonna start off T even, right, right down the middle of our body. We wanna start with our feet closer than shoulders uh, width apart. We're gonna jump back, stay in a good dynamic position, and then fire immediately off that backside, driving through the zone, and again, holding that finish after contact. Go ahead and take a few, coach. Notice that as soon as that back foot comes down, he's driving forward into the baseball. Good. This also reinforces one of the basic fundamentals of hitting, and that is we have to go back to go forward. 